Hey, hey guys, welcome to my channel. It is Dallas Gordon here. And I wanted to just hit you off with this quick video with how to save a Canva GIF um, for your social media or anywhere else that you know you would like to use it. I specifically use these GIFs um, on my Instagram account. Um, I know that GIFs work differently on different platforms. For instance, I have had some problems sharing um, GIFs from the internet or from Jiffy.com on Facebook. Facebook kind of has has its own GIFs that you can choose from because um, you can run into issues with these. But I've definitely used GIFs in like my emails. I've used GIFs um, on Instagram as well with no problems at all. So just wanted to put that out there. So guys, if you're new to my channel, I want to say a big, huge welcome. Thank you so much for stopping by on this video. My name is Coach Dallas Gordon. I'm a spiritual business coach for impact-driven womenpreneurs. So if you are looking to get aligned with spiritual and business, you're looking to learn attraction marketing and to dominate product sales in your niche, you have landed on the right video. So thank you so much for coming by. If you love this content, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so that you know when I drop this hot content every single week. I've got some amazing content for you guys. I've been hitting about three videos a week, so hope you've been enjoying it. And I just love it when you guys comment below. Let me know your thoughts on the video. Let me know what tips were most helpful. And let me know more about what you would like to see on this channel. Guys, I've also got some amazing resources in the description of this video, I have an entire training vault where you can access my content. Um, you're going to have to actually DM me for that link for now until I get the page back up and running um, where I'm giving insider trainings, templates, all kinds of stuff to market and to run your online business successfully. I also have some amazing freebies below and I have my amazing group Ecom for Women, which is a Facebook group. Feel free to give that group a join once you subscribe to this channel and you'll be able to learn some amazing tips and get some cool live trainings. All right. So enough about that and enough about me let's get into this video so in the past and what you may have done if you're on this video is when you save a gif in canva and then you try to upload it onto instagram if you save it as a gif it may not perform as a gif is supposed to perform it may show up on your social media feed as a still photo because there's just a little trick okay and the trick is in how you save the video. So first of all, let's talk about saving the GIFs and uploading them into Canva. So I typically go guys to jiffy.com and I'll show you. I go to jiffy.com and I look for whatever GIF I want to use on my social media post. So and jiffy.com is awesome because you can pretty much type in any expression. I'll give you an example. Like I can't believe this. Right, and it will really like pull up the expressions <laughs> that you're thinking of, which I think is pretty Shut up. cool. Shut up! Oh man, why is it making noise like that? Let me turn that one off. Okay. So let's just say we take this one right here. Where she's saying, I can't believe this, right? So typically what I do, guys, is I just, if you're on a um, Mac, I do control with the left button. If you're on a Windows, I believe it's just like you right click the GIF and then you save the GIF as an image on your computer. So I'm just gonna save it under, I can't believe this GIF, okay? Then I'm going to go over to Canva. And there are other ways that you can save these guys. You can copy the link. You can share it directly to the social media website. But that's typically how I get them for emails and for Instagram. I just, you know, um, I just click the right click if you're a Windows or control left click if you're a Mac. And I save the, G the GIF that way. So now I'm going to go back to Canva. And let's just say that I want to... Um, and this is like my file, guys, with many of my social media images. So I just keep a big file of all of them. And then I just edit them every month 
for the new content that I want to post. Okay, so let's just say I want to replace this one with the one that I just saved. Well, it's at the bottom of my computer, so all I really have to do is just drop, drag and drop it in, just like that. So if it worked or not. So I'll do it again. Is it in here? What's going on? Here it is. And I did it twice. And all I'm gonna do is just drag this into the image to replace that one. So there it is, I can't believe this, right? So what I'm gonna do now is now it's time for me to actually download and save the GIF so that I can make it available for my social media account, okay? So this is where the trick kind of comes in because if you save this as a GIF, most likely it's not going to work um, on Instagram or the other places that you're trying to use it. So I'm just gonna download it. Um, I'm gonna say, I wanna download page four. And what you wanna do guys, when you save it, you wanna make sure that you save it as a MP4 video, okay? An MP4 video. So you see that there are other things that you can do in here. You can do a GIF. But I, when I do that, it does not work for me. So you want to make sure that you select MP4 video um, from the file section, okay? And then from there, you can download and save it to your computer. From here, guys, once you upload this to Instagram or your social media scheduling tool or you use it in your email or whatever you want to do, now the GIF is going to be active like you want it to be. It's going to be moving around. And it's not going to post as like that still image that you don't want. So... I hope that this video was helpful, guys. Um, don't forget to drop me a comment on this video and definitely share it out. If you love the content on this channel and it really helped you out, be sure to hit the subscribe button and check out the description box for the many different resources I have for you to help you to grow your online business. So be blessed, guys, and I'll see you in the next video.